The coffee pot's on, the welcome mat's out. We know what our being's all about. Hey folks, this is Devin with Sutton RV in Eugene, Oregon. It's a beautiful day here in the Northwest. Today I want to talk about our 139T Sunray. Uh, it's an awesome travel trailer, extremely light. It's 1,800 pounds dry. Uh, as you can see, we have a toy hauler capability. I would suggest more electric bikes, kayaks, bicycles, you name it. Uh, inside at the moment, we have a spare tire from the factory, but we do have four points of tie down. So whatever you did want to throw in here, it won't be moving around left and right while you're traveling. You may ask where the bed is. The bed is located nicely there, drops on down. You got a nice comfortable mattress. Simply just shutting the door like this will get you make sure you're nice and secure while you take a nap. We all LED lights, exterior and interior on this travel trailer. We are wired for backup camera. And as I take you around this area, we have all of our connections. We have our fresh water connection. We have our city water connection. Over here, as you can see, we have an outside kitchen. This model here doesn't have a traditional awning. It is a bagged awning but we do have this it's nice and high I am five foot ten we have our nice freezer for ice cream and all the other goodies and refrigerator over here we're gonna have the two burners propane and then we're gonna have a nice sink here with plenty of storage above storage below 110 outlets you name it exterior speakers and interior speakers so they want you to have fun outside, enjoy camping. Now I'm going to take you on in. As you can see, though, real quick, I want to point out, we do have a six-inch lift. This is the Sport. You can get it in the Classic, which wouldn't come with the off-roaded tire and that lift. Inward, we have, again, I'm 5'10", trying to use this as a visual example of the headroom we have in this light trailer. It's 1,800 pounds dry with a gross vehicle weight rating of 3,500. An overall length of 15 feet, 5 inches, and that's from the ball to the back. Um, we have we threw in a nice little handy sink here, hot and cold, the counter space, 110 outlets, USB for charging, storage along underneath here, and a nicely located microwave for some of that popcorn. Uh, this is what's going to control music. It's going to be Bluetooth, AM, FM. And everything is hardwired for your TV hookup because we do have a TV backer to locate a TV here. Bathroom. All righty. Fantastic fan right above your bedding. So the, if you're not fortunate enough to be plugged into a 30 amp power service to run something like your air conditioner, because it does have an air conditioner, it does have heat. You also have an electric fantastic fan with three different speeds. And also you can enjoy the view and, the, and all the air that comes with it. Over here, we're gonna have our control panels. This is gonna give us our ability to turn on and off our lights, check our, our gas, our water pump, check our, uh, our, our tanks, make sure that they're uh, uh, not all the way full before you take off. Along here, we'll have our heat Dometic thermostat here and a nice little place to take a seat, uh, take your shoes off and relax for the evening. All right, guys, and then also not to forget, we have an air conditioner with this. It's a residential side mounted air conditioner. Nice thing about this is if anything goes wrong, it's a quick replacement straight out of Jerry's or Home Depot. Again, LED lights, interior speakers, more outlets. All right, guys, well, you know what? I'm really looking forward to seeing you. We have 129s, 139s, 109s. We have the whole line. I personally own a 16BH Sunlight, so I'm a big fan of this manufacturer. But uh, either way, guys, I can't wait to see it, and you're going to like it here. Living each day at your own pace, moving down the road from place to place. We can make your dreams come true in your very own eyes.